What's going on guys? How are you doing today? Right now I am in Chicago, Illinois, or just a little bit south of Chicago. I'm at a place called Mount Olivet Cemetery. And if you haven't heard of this, this is something that I actually did not know until just a little bit ago. I went and did a video on Al Capone's grave at Mount Carmel Cemetery. And what I did not know is that Al Capone, he died in 1947 in Florida. He was brought back to Chicago. He was buried in Chicago. Now, he was not originally buried at Mount Carmel Cemetery. He was originally buried here. And I never knew this until just a few weeks ago, but this is the original gravestone of Al Capone. He was buried here in 1947, and then he was dug up in 1952. Now, his father was buried here, and his brother, Salvatore, otherwise known as Frank, was also buried here. But um, the cemetery here really didn't like Al Capone being buried here because it brought a lot of people here, and people would come here and desecrate the grave. And they tipped it over a few times, which if you can see how big this thing is, I have no idea how anybody tipped this thing over. But this is the original burial location of Al Capone. Now, the neat thing about this is that, like I said, this was the original burial place of not only Al, but his brother and his father. But in 1952, his mother had a plot at Mount Carmel Cemetery that was big enough for the entire family. So Al was basically dug up right here, and they were taken over to Mount Carmel Cemetery. But I just found this to be kind of fascinating because, you know, not a lot of people know that this is here. And the fact that nobody's buried here, I mean, this is an empty, empty burial plot, is kind of fascinating to me. Now you can see that somebody put a sticker right here which is kind of disrespectful, even though Al isn't home. But um, these are the where the pictures would have been of Al and his father or brother. And you can see that those are gone as well. But right here, Al Capone, 1899 to 1947. And he was buried here for five years. Pretty cool little piece of history. And something I definitely never knew. Now this is a pretty neat cemetery, so if you ever get a chance to visit, a lot of these ones in Chicago are pretty awesome, um, especially Mount Carmel, if, you, if you've if you never gotten a chance to go there. Not only is Al Capone buried there, but most of his associates are buried there. Um, actor Dennis Farina is also buried there, but it's also just a neat place to be in terms of um, architecture and sculptures and all that stuff. So if cemeteries are your thing, be sure to put these two places on your list. But that's all I have for right now. Thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy and have a great day.